Hi, hello dear students. Welcome to our channel, Maths with Panindra. In this video, we are going to discuss about differentiation for mass questions. This problem is related to parametric differentiation. Let us have a discussion of the question. If x equal to a into cos t plus log of tan t by 2, y equal to a sin t, find dy by dx. So they are asking to find dy by dx. x in terms of t, y in terms of t. So x dx by dt calculate, dy by dt you have to calculate and find dy by dx. So first x equal to a into cos t plus log of tan t by 2. This is the given one. x whenever it is in terms of t, differentiate with respect to t. So, x differentiate with respect to t, we can write it as dx by dt is equal to a constant we can take outside. Constant into function is there. Constant we can take outside d by dt of cos t, d by dx of cos x is what? Minus sin x. d by dt of cos t is minus sin t. Plus, d by dt of log f of x, 1 by f of x, again f of x also differentiate. d by dt of log tan t by 2 is 1 by tan t by 2. Again tan t by 2 derivative. Tan x derivative is what? Secant square x. So tan t by 2 derivative is secant square t by 2. Again t by 2 derivative also 1 by 2. This is the way you can do dear students. Once again I will repeat. d by dt of log tan t by 2 is 1 by tan t by 2. Again tan t by 2 derivative is secant square t by 2. Again t by 2 also differentiate 1 by 2. We can stop it there. Now simplification, a into minus sin t plus cos secant square t means 1 by cos square t by tan t by 2 means sin t by 2 by, sorry t here also, sin t by 2 by cos t by 2 into 1 by 2. 1 of the cos t by 2 get cancelled. Even cos t by 2 also it will come to the denominator. So it will be a into minus sin t plus 1 by 2 into sin t by 2 into cos t by 2. 2 sin t by 2 into cos t by 2. We know that from multiple and submultiples, 2 sin a by 2 cos a by 2 means sin t only, no? So, we can write it as a into minus sin t plus 1 by sin t. So, after taking LCM, it will becomes a into sin t into minus sin t minus sin square t. plus 1 by sin t. Are you able to see these students? One minute. Yes. 1 minus sin square theta. What is that 1 minus sin square theta? Cos theta. Cos square theta. So a into 1 minus sin square t is cos square t by sin t. This is the value of dx by dt. Therefore, dx by dt is equal to a cos square t by sin t. You put it in box, dear students. So next, y value is given now. Here only we complete it y equal to a into sin t 
differentiate with respect to t so dy by dt is equal to a into d by dt of sin t cos t so dy by dt value we got it as a cos t and dx by dt value is a cos square t by sin t so now dy by dx equal to dy by dt whole divided by dx by dt this is the formula dear students for mass question important so dy by dt value is what a cos t by 2 cos t so a cos t by dx by dt value is what a cos square t by sin t a a get cancel one of the cos t also cancel 1 by cos t by sin t is cot t 1 by cot t so otherwise sin t will become numerator sin t divided by denominator of denominator by cos t that is equal to tan t so therefore dy by dx equal to tan t i hope you understand the students this is the way we can do that uh, the parametric differentiation this is the four mass question dear students you remember